Stop Child Trafficking. Um, and it is the kind of the first annual walk for this organization, Stop Child Trafficking Now. Um, I'm the event director and Toronto Community Ambassador for the walk. This weekend, joining across Canada, across the United States, uh, over in Europe, in Paris, I believe, and in Australia, we have over 4,000 walkers who are walking this weekend to raise awareness about stop child trafficking. Yes. Because they convince them, come with us. Come with us. And they give the kids anything they want. If they want friends, they've got friends. If they want drugs, they've got drugs. If they want to party, they can party. But you know, based on what they see on TV, based on what their lives are, based on peer pressure, they think they're just going to have a good time and be really popular. They have no idea the horrors that wait them. As a survivor who's been trafficked to Canada in 1998, this is truly an emotional moment because I look around and I see people who actually know what human trafficking is and see people coming out on a Sunday morning and fighting for a cause that 13 years ago wasn't even on the map. When I was trafficked, I was probably standing behind you in a Starbucks. I hear you make a stand in a place that's been so silent. So give me a voice to the voiceless. Pretty much I heard about the cause from my brother Joel, who works for Joy Smith. And I heard it from her. Yeah. <laughs> once you kind of find out about human trafficking, you have to do something. And the walk was our outlet. Yeah. And Jay went with me. So I got a taste awesome. of it last year. I knew I had to contribute to this year's uh, cause. One, in order to fight it, you need to raise the awareness. So we encourage people to come out to an event like this, get online, learn a few stats and start sharing it with people. If you don't know where to look, you can start by coming to um, our website, which is www. I think I put four in there. www.freethem.ca and there's uh, resources there, write to your MP, tell them to stop uh, human trafficking, get on board, start learning what is going on in our government and support a local anti-trafficking organization. We need the volunteers and we're always looking for people to partner with us.